What's up guys, Evil Deer here. So today I'm going to be playing this iPad game called What The Shell. Now my particular interest in this game is the fact that it's been translated to Esperanto. Well actually it's, it's available in English, it's available in German from what I've heard, and it's also available in Esperanto. It's a small little iPad game but it's been translated and that, that caught my attention. Now it's called What The Shell. Now one thing you gotta realize because I made this mistake when I first um, tried to download the game is, is that it's only available on iPad. So I was sitting there on my iPhone going, mm, why can't I find it, mm, type of thing. And it took me probably about 15 minutes before I realized it was an iPad only game. Now, the other thing you'll want to realize is when you open it up, there's no language selection. It's just straight away into English. And I was like looking around for like the little Esperanto flag or something and going through all the settings, but I, I couldn't find anything. Now what you need to do <clears throat> is you need to go into the settings on your iPad first up then you need to go down to general which I'm already on you need to then go down to language and region and you need to add Esperanto as a preferred language and have it first type of thing um, the reason being is because it obviously picks up the languages that you've got available on your iPad. Whoa, check out the blue glow on my face, that's awesome! <laughs> Sorry, I just had a little bit too much fun there. Um, so yeah, it obviously picks up whatever language is on the iPad. Now, if the developer at any point actually watches this, I guess, let's play of this game, I would recommend to him that it doesn't do that and instead that there's just a flag or something because that would just simplify the whole process. I'm not sure why they didn't do that, maybe there was like a technical reason or whatever. But anyway, let's just get into the game. So it's called What the Shell, and as you can see we've got three options down here. We've got Ludi, Klubo and Prini. Um, Ludi is to play, Klubo is like club and Prini is about us. Um, as you can see there's no other settings on this front page, so you basically just go into play mode. Now what you've got is Lokala and Reta, and Lokala is like local, and Reta is like internet, so network based, okay? <clears throat> now on the left hand of Lokala, you've actually got, you can play with like other people, or you can play, like you can play with other people, I'm guessing through like Wi-Fi or something like that, I haven't got anyone else to play with, I'm a loner. <laughs> but anyway! So you can play with other people or you can, you've got Learn Program up here which um, teaches you about the game and then you've got Verse uh, Computillo down the bottom which is, you know, Verse the Computer. Now, <clears throat> it looks like, I'm just going to go into Verse the Computer mode, it looks like a very simple game. I went through the indu like the induction, sorry, it's like, um, I guess it's like uh, the Help Program, that's what they call it, the Help Program. Um, and it's basically, I put down a turtle, so for instance, I am V at the moment, on the red turtle down here. You put down a turtle and then the computer player puts down a turtle, but you actually both put it down at the same time. And at first it looks like a very simple game, but I quickly found out it's actually quite complex. Well, not really complex, but just hard. So the idea is that you've got to get five of these turtles in a row, okay? Now, that seems simple enough. However, the computer player is smart enough to realize that um, you're trying to do that. Not, you can get five lined up turtles, both diagonally and also um, up, down, diagonally, all that good jazz. Now, the trick of the game is, you see how this, like, the computer he's put his little green one down there, and if I put it up the top, you notice this little egg thing that's formed? What's happened is both me and the computer player have selected the same spot to land on. And when that happens, we both crash and we create this egg. I guess we merge and we, we give birth to this egg. <laughs> um, and basically that egg just sits there. Now, what happens is, there is a way to actually destroy your enemy to try and line up five turtles in a row in whatever way. And that is, you see how we've got like these two lined up just here, the two green ones? Oh, I haven't got like a mouse point or anything, but it's kind of obvious. There's two green ones right next to each other. If I put something above, see how those two green ones disappeared and the egg it just hatched? And then I've killed these ones? Holy crap, that's the first time I've ever won this game! <laughs> I literally played this for like half an hour today and got dominated every single time by the computer. That was... Well, I'm done. I'm done. No, but the idea is... Okay, I'll just start again. So we'll just go, um, Nova Ludo, which means new game. The idea is that you've got to line up, I think it's five, and then then you win, okay? But the way to defeat your opponent is if they get like two in a row and you've got like, say, one on the left and then they've got two, what you can then do is put one on the right as you just saw and it kills those two in the middle but if there's an egg 
anywhere on the screen, it hatches as your egg which means you get another player on the field instantly. So you can see this guy, he's trying to try some diagonal stuff at the moment. So I just cut him off, now I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna see if I can do that again, if, I'm gonna, if I can beat this game again, because I've never beaten it, and I literally sat there for like half an hour today going <laughs> trying to beat it. This is so annoying. Okay, so there we go. Now if I go here, and see Mr. Green Turtle, he's just interrupted my attack mode just there. He's trying to do a diagonal. Now I'm gonna come up here, I'm gonna put my dude up there, we're gonna hatch some more eggs in some random red-green merger, I guess. I'm gonna put something here, because he's trying to do some more sneaky stuff, I just know it. I know him, he's up to something bad. I don't even know what I'm doing right now. I'm just um, randomly putting turtles down, because that's what you do. Oh, well, I better put something there. Yeah, I'm on to you, mate, I'm on to you. By the way, the word for turtle in Esperanto is testudo. And you probably realize there isn't really that much Esperanto in this game. It's literally just like the, the main menu and stuff like that. But, you know what? I wanted to play the game because I support the language and I want to help those developers who are making games in this language. So if you're, make, if you're a developer, like a game developer or something, I don't care how crappy your game is, I'll give it a go. I'm not implying that this game is crappy, this is actually really well made. And the computer just vekes min. The computer just defeated me again. Okay, so yeah, this is actually, well, hello, <laughs> how are you? I guess that's how he makes his money, through advertisements, I totally forgot about that. Um, so let's just try some tricky stuff, I'm going to put some turtles here. Um, I'm actually not even really thinking this out. Let's see, I'm going to put one there because... Oh, you little bugger! You know what, I'm going to get revenge- Oh, damn it, you turned me into an egg. Ugh. So I'm going to put one here, interrupt him, and now I'm going to put some here. I'm going to keep playing this until I win again. Last time was like pure fluke. Because I wasn't paying attention was the reason I won. It was just pure chance playing in my favor because there's no way that that computer just... Yeah, I don't know, I don't know. Let's just try some tricky stuff. So I'm gonna put this here. Stop egging me! Ah, there's so many eggs! I'm gonna defeat you! I'll kill you! I'll kill... Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. This is going bad, this is going bad. I'm gonna put something right here because I know he's up to something bad. I just know it. I just know it. I know your people's... What's he up to? What's he up to? He's got a plan in here. There is a plan in this chaos. I just know it. I know he's up to something. I'm gonna put something there. Oh, damn it! Damn it! <laughs> I knew he was up to something. Okay, let's go again. Round three. So let's just drop a testudo there. I'm gonna put another testudo there. Uh, I'm gonna put another one just here. And I'm gonna put another one just to here. And then, of course, he's gonna interrupt me like that, being completely rude individual that he is. I didn't even see that. That was... See what I mean? See what I mean? This could actually be a lot of fun against like an actual real living, breathing human being as opposed to a computer because the computer's just gonna defeat me just because, you know, this is like Matrix type stuff here, man. The computer will always defeat me. I'm just waiting for Morpheus to pop out and go, choose between the red turtle and the green turtle. La verda testuda and la kai la ruja testuda. I don't know, I'm smoking something at the moment. Oh, God damn it. I thought if I stopped paying attention, I'd just win. I, I'm just letting him axe me at the moment. This is really bad. Oh, God damn it! I didn't even see that tricky combination there. I will kill you for this! Okay, let's go. And go away, random woman. Go, go. Oh, God damn it! Go! Okay, let's go again. Um, I've got this. I've got this. I'm gonna so destroy you. Oh, damn it. I'm gonna go here. I know your master plan. I know you too well. I have seen the devil in your eyes. Okay, let's go here. <gasps> oh, oh, almost gave that one to him. Almost gave that one to him. Uh, let's see what I can do. I'm gonna put one here. Stop eating my turtles! They're mine! How did, what? I didn't even, ah! Okay, you know, if I actually paid attention, I like looked over at all the little turtles and stuff, you know, ah, you know what we need? We need an Internacia Testuda Concurso, an international turtle contest in Esperanto. Let's make this a thing, people. If you're watching this video right now, let's make this a thing. I'm just going to see if I can outlast this dude. Yeah, I'll put one there. Yeah, I know you're going to do that. You're going to egg me. Okay, I've just covered that whole field off. 
Yep, I'm happy with that. He ain't doing nothing. He ain't nothing now, mate. Yeehaw! I don't know where that random sound effect just came from. There's a lot of eggs on this field, I'll tell you that much. There's a lot of eggs. Um, I'm just gonna randomly line it up. How did you... What? No! You can't do that! What? What? Faculty! God damn it! Okay, I might have to actually, like, speed up some of these random, like, games to the point where I actually win again. I want to mess with him. I'll put one there. I did it! <laughs> oh. Okay, guys, well, I don't think I've got this. No, honestly, I, this guy's got me good. Anyway, that there is the game, which is called, because I totally forgot, What the Shell. It is a free download, so go and download it. And I'm actually looking forward to, in the future, when we can play online, because it says Venus Baldal, which means it will come soon. When that comes, I am so going to play some online games with some of you guys. Um, that's if you want to play with me. I know I'm really bad and all, but maybe you enjoy defeating me. Or maybe I'm just playing bad right now so I can defeat you later. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, that's pretty much the game. I recommend you go download it just for like a little bit of fun. It's probably, you probably get about five minutes of fun out of it and then you'll get bored as the computer keeps defeating you and laughing at you type of thing. But yeah, that's it. So that is What The Shell. Anyway, if you've liked this video, give it a like, share with your friends, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next video. And if not, well, no amount of turtles will save you. <laughs>